Good morning, everybody. So we are at Burlington and we, oh, you can't even see it, the tree. All right, well, let's just go. We're gonna go to Burlington and then I am solo, no kids, so that's awesome. I am going to go into Burlington and see what fun things that we can find. All right, let's go. Last time I came here, they had amazing things. So let's see what we can find. Okay guys, so I know you didn't see much, but I did get a few small things. Um, everything was very sparse. It wasn't very much stuff out on the shelves. Um, it seemed pretty dry, um, but then again, most of the time when I do my Burlington videos, I am going during the week, and I'm doing it today on a Saturday. So maybe that is a little something to do with it, maybe. But they were out there stocking shelves and everything, so you know, I'm gonna hit another Burlington and Maybe we'll have some better luck, but I did buy a few things. So one of them I've been eyeing for like a few weeks, but I went ahead and got it because it was still there. So um, let's go another Burlington. Um, I have another. I have a, an appointment to do right now, and then so we're gonna fast forward when you see this, and you're gonna send, see if we can find anything else. So see you there. Hey, you guys. Okay, so it has actually been about two weeks since the start of this video. Um, it life has been so crazy. My husband's job schedule changed dramatically. He was night shift. Now he's morning shift. So it's really adjusted me as far as when I do my hunting and whatnot. But I'm here. It is a Sunday. I have never been to Burlington on a Sunday, let alone the afternoon. It is 102 in the afternoon. This place is slammed. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to film much if we can actually find anything. So I've got my mask and I have no kids with me. My husband is watching them. So let's go ahead inside and see if we can find anything. If I do not show you things that I find due to you know it being too busy or whatnot, then stay tuned to the end and hopefully there will be a little bit of a haul. So without further ado, thank you so much for stopping by and let's, let's start this trip. So I've already realized that there is no pins, so let's go into the back and see what we can find.
Okay, you guys, this place is jam-packed. Like, I came out of the store and the parking lot is completely full of people. Um, I did had to stop filming because there was so many people walking everywhere. But it seemed like most of the people went to the clothing. And I wanted to go over there and see what Disney goodies I could find. However, that just, to me, wasn't going to happen. Um, but I did get a few really, really good things, all Disney products. So let's go home and I'll go ahead and show you what fun things we got all together from this last trip and now. So I'll see you in a few seconds. Hey everybody, okay, I am home now. I have a smokes. As soon as I got home, she insisted on seeing and bunny. Okay, enough about the cats, the crazy cat lady. So I did do some really good shopping over the first time and then the one we saw right now. So I'm gonna go over real quickly of what we went ahead and got. Now it won't necessarily be in order. I'm sorry if it feels like this is a mess right now. I wasn't expecting to film and then here we are. Um, but real quick, so I had actually seen this Monsters Cup weeks ago and I actually passed on it and um, Karen from Inside Ant. But I'll go ahead and leave the YouTuber that actually said, oh my gosh, go back and get it. I will to leave her, her name is Karen um, and her son is Andy. Um, so if you're watching Karen and Andy, hi. Um, but having a total blonde moment, um, I'll leave their link down below but she had told me to go get this weeks ago and I didn't actually end up getting it. And I realized, you know what? I need to go get it. So here we have um, Monsters Inc. Cup. I think it's really, really fun. And I like how it says Top Scarer on the inside of the cup. This was $4.99. And we know nowadays with the whole new uh, Monsters Inc. show, they're not scares anymore. So I think that's really fun. If you haven't watched that new show on Netflix, or oh, Netflix, all wrong, Disney Plus. If you see it on Disney Plus, it's a really fun show for all the whole family. So this mug was really fun. I figured, you know what? This is something the whole family can use for whatever they want. And I figured this is really cute. So I tend to collect a lot of mugs when I go to Burlington. And it just continues. I think I'm going to have more mugs than any dishware. Um, and so then I went ahead and found this randomly. And I never go down this one specific aisle. And for some reason, I went down it and I found these. And I thought these were really, really cool. So it is Star Wars glassware set of four. They're 10 ounces. And I was like, what's 10 ounces? Like, what is that? But looking at it, I was like, you know what? Maybe these are like mojito glasses. And... I didn't want to open it at the store, so I waited till I got home. And literally, they look like mojito glasses, but like imagine drinking a mojito or something out of this. How cute! I think these are really cute. So they come in different ones. This one's like him sleeping. This one says, Wait for me. I will say, just looking at it now, they clearly need to be cleaned. And I don't know, you might not want to put these in the dishwasher. You know, I could be wrong break it okay I could be wrong but you know if you ever see this at your store and you buy it maybe don't put it in the washer um this one says gimme gimme one of the best parts I think in the series really cute and then this last one says nom 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 <laughs> one of my favorites as well him drinking his little soup really cute and one thing I do like about Burlington, I know a lot of stores actually do do it, but I never actually would buy a bunch of glassware until Burlington. But they package things really, really well when it comes to like when you buy your glassware. So that's really good. And you know, you come home and it's like packaged really well. Um, and I believe that was it for that Burlington day. Um, moving on to today's Burlington. I was shocked. I never go on a Sunday. I always go during midweek, but like I said earlier with you guys that the schedule has changed, so I don't know if I'll necessarily go on a Sunday again, 
but it was plenty to choose from. There was more that I actually wanted to get, however, I just didn't. But I saw this cup and I knew it was my husband all over it. So it is Luke Skywalker. And it is on the back here, it says, I am Luke Skywalker, I'm here to rescue you. This is a really, really small mug. I would honestly probably say eight ounces, maybe. I could be wrong. I'm not like a huge cup person. Even though I have cups, I guess I don't pay attention. But it is a really small mug, but it is simple, but yet, you know, to the point. So we have a Luke Skywalker cup. Moving on, my daughter is a huge, huge Star Wars fan, as well as a Darth Vader fan. And so for me, this literally screamed her name all over it. I hopefully it's not too hard for you to see. At the store, I honestly didn't see it. I was on the phone with my husband and I had seen this. I'm like, what cup is all black? That's weird. And I turned and I saw that and I was like, okay, that that's her cup. So let's see, like they pack it really, really well to where sometimes I don't think I can get it out. But here, just normal black on the inside. And for the most part, Burlington cups that I've realized are about $4.99 a piece. Yes, you can get them maybe a dollar cheaper, maybe elsewhere. But I have noticed that most cups are $4.99. But a lot of them are Disney mugs. So for the most part, that is really good. So I figured a Darth Vader cup was a must. And it was the only one there as well, along with the Luke Skywalker um okay moving on these were really random um they've had a few there but i figured you know this is like totally me you know it has mickey from all over the generations this is a um shelves <laughs> and i think they're really beautiful and really cute and they come with a set of two and this was for 14.99 it was originally valued for $24. I need to learn to read. <laughs> you can see right there. And I just think these are really, really cute. Maybe you put like a few Mickey Pops on it or, you know, really whatever you really want. I think, and they're very heavy. So I figured $14.99 for two shelves that are really good quality. I don't think that's a bad deal. And it did come with a little hardware. It did have these little hardware literally just laying on top to where when I was picking it up, I was thinking to myself, did this even go together? But then I realized everything had that. So, and then I got this for my husband. It is another, the same thing, a wall shelf, and there's two for $14.99 as well. And it is Star Wars. And it's like all the original. I'm pretty sure both shelves are the same. I could be wrong. Um, I have not opened them yet. Um, but I think these were really, really cool. And right up my husband's alley. He is a huge Star Wars fan, as we all are. But I think he's the most. Um, so, and this is just really, really cool. And it very, very heavy, like I said. So when I was walking out, it was all really heavy. But... That is all I have for today in this Burlington haul. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're a returning viewer, thank you so much for returning. And if you haven't done so already, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and that cute little bell so you can stay updated for future videos. That is it for today's video. Me and Smokes say goodbye. Bye, guys.